All right, guys. Today I want to show you um, that um, if you have a Verizon Note Five, you can actually use it on AT&T or T-Mobile. And I'm gonna just show you how it can be done. So I pop out the SIM card tray, and I'm using Cricut wireless which uses AT&T network I put it it on the SIM card tray alright as you can see let me try to focus Cricut wireless and then pop it right in the Verizon um, I could restart the Verizon uh, Note 5 comes factory unlock, which means if you bought it online on Craigslist or Swapper, you uh, can use it on either of these network, or even if you are overseas. Here's the Verizon logo. There it is, right here, AT&T Network, Verizon SIM card, and it, oops. Okay, let me add this, go to setting, about phone, Okay, status. As you can see, the network is on AT&T. I am connected to the LTE right here. So it can, it will be, you'll be able to work it. But if any of you is using it for Cricket Wireless, um, that is if you are using on Cr Cricket or AT&T. There's one issue, is when someone calls you, um, you will have a issue um, where there will be a plus sign in front of the number, which you won't be able to call back on your call log. So that's one issue, and uh, if you are using okay guys just give me a second here let me clear all this out um, if you use for picture messaging you will have issues with it because um, if you're using on a cricket I have to find um, the APN I can't use a cricket wireless APN and it it just wouldn't send the uh, MMS um, through so I have to use the AT&T APN so that's something to think about but um, people who are on um, using it on T-Mobile have no issue so far that I know of so that guys there you have it Verizon Note 4 Note 5 4G LTE with a um, Cricket Wireless AT&T SIM card.